Yo, what is up guys? This is Tian Si, and welcome here with another tips and tricks video. So without further ado, let's begin. Flashing during Shen's taunt. You can use flash during Shen's taunt. This opens up a lot of possibilities. Obviously, it extends the range of your taunt, but at the same time, you can be a lot more accurate. If your enemy moves to the side, you can flash after them and still land the taunt. Watch these next few clips to have a general idea as to what I mean. Just because you've started an objective doesn't mean that you have to finish it. A mistake that players make all the time is to continue fighting Dragon or Baron just because they've already taken it to half health. When they do this, not only do they have to fight the enemy, they have to deal with the damage that they're taking from the objective as well. If you can't finish the objective quickly, just give it up and back off. In this game, my team is positioning for Baron, but, un but unfortunately the enemy knows this and comes to stop us. We attempt to Baron two times but back off. If we had kept attacking Baron, there is a possibility that the enemy could have stolen it and killed us. We play it safe and just back off. Eventually our bot lane pushes in and forces the enemy to defend their base. Now that they are missing players, we have an easy Baron and end the game without any trouble. Turret diving is super common, so players with more knowledge of turret ranges and how turrets work have an easier time diving. One thing to keep in mind is that turrets only attack targets when they are aggroing an ally champion within turret range. Aggroing means to attack. As you can see here, I dive rumble, but am not attacked by the turret after I walk out of range. At the same time, rumble also puts himself out of turret range. Because of this, Kaylee can freely attack rumble without worrying about the turret targeting her. When you're running away, do not group up. Grouping up only makes it easier for champions with AoE to clean up. Try to spread out. By spreading out, you force the enemy to choose targets and increase the chances of you surviving. As you can see here, these kids are running away in a little douche ball of champions. All I have to do is cast one AoE spell to clean up all three of them. I hope you guys enjoyed that. If you guys want to see more, please like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And also, this month's winner of $10 in RP is currently being decided. So make sure you're subscribed if you want to win that RP.